All right, what's up ladies and gentlemen, it's time for more Aether Raids. Um, we have a lot of bonus units this week that we like to use, um, but I don't have that many blessings, so we can only use um, Sonia and who else? I think Tiandra, I think is what we'll be using. We didn't use Pioneer for defense, so at least we did that. Anyway, this is the first match we're going to be playing against. We're against our favorite duo from the past, duo Byleth. They used to use her a lot in Aether Raids, but not anymore. Um, we have Hell, you got that Refine, who can teleport within four spaces of enemy units. You have so this who people tend to <laughs> say it got outdated very quickly, if even dated at all, when she got refined and remixed. You have Yoon plus one, very good unit. We have not. No, that's it, just not. <laughs> we have Ray Marianne, and we also have Tiandra. Tiandra is the bonus, so she will be the one that's locked out. So, uh, what we need to know about here. Um, does Marianne have any warping of any kind? No, just the the ignore damage reduction stuff. Okay, so that's very good. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna use Ninja Camilla here. Um, whenever we see Yoon, Garrick, it's it's always Garrick time because Garrick's very good against Yoon. He has everything that you would want against Yoon. So that's what we're going to be using. Ninja Camilla is going to be beefed up and going to try and take out Hell, probably Summer Violet, So This, and Yoon all at once. We'll leave Yacht, uh, not Yacht, not and Marianne for the next turn, which will be turn three. And hopefully we can deal with Tiandra at the end. We're gonna try and also get the pots as well. We're gonna use a team that has Garrick in it. So that's team two. Um, Sony is in this team, but Sony is not really gonna do much for this first match at least. We don't know about the other matches, but for this first match, not that much. And yeah, we're just gonna see if we can get the pots before Tiandra ends up trying to attack us. So this is what we'll do. So what we want is we want Mila to be silencing Tiandra, so Mila's going to be in this lane. Um, there's no wind sweep of any kind, so we're fine. Camilla's just going to be in this lane. It's going to break everything here, essentially. Um, yeah, it's going to break here, everything here, essentially. And then from there, yeah, that's it. And then, I guess, um, Sony could just be on... I mean, this, do we need exposure on any of these hits? We don't really need exposure on any of these hits. Uh, maybe Yoon, if anything, but uh, I also doubt it as well. Uh, so let's see Go here. For yeah, we could just break this, no problem, actually. Hey. Yeah, we oh, could just break up. this. I go. Wise choice. Hey. So let's do... Let's try and break this for now. I'm just trying to think, is there any reason why I wouldn't want to break this? None that I can think of. Okay. It will be We're gonna done. reposition Sonia. Yes. Sonia's yes. gonna move. Oh, I should actually reposition the... Uh... Well, that's fine. We're not for doing anything terminal anyway. Land. So, Camilla's so gonna break this. So fun. Orders. Turn one. Looks like it's Azura's gonna turn. break that. We don't have animations on because I was doing temper trials. We're back. As can I'll break be. this. Am I needed? And her dudes can just be like right here for now. Okay, so the main thing here is again, Camilla has the nullify penalty, so that's kind of good. She also has a seal res, so we should be fine. Um. I bestow so my blessing. I'm going to move. I'm going to move I'll Sonia go. about here. Oh yes. We'll do this. Got a plan. We'll do this. Orders. And then Camilla is just going to. I do not know. Take out hell. You can. Oh, right here, okay. Be. No hard feelings, dear. And then from there, Camilla should be able to sweep at least three of these units here. Oh my god, plus 30 attack, plus 25 res. What? Alright, Camilla's also gonna take out still this. No issue. We'll see this and then Dual Violet should be next. Huh. Alright, and then that's all good. 
As we said, we have uh, Marianne and Teandra last. Uh, Looks let me like see. it's my turn. wise choice. Orders. I'm gonna make sure. Okay, so we can take out Marianne. That's very good. Let's see that first. Except they have a lot of buffs. They have a lot. Okay. Yes. So fun for all life on land. Like this. Am I needed? I want to make sure everything's all good and gravy. I bestow my blessing. Hey. Off I go. Hmm. Yes. Let's. I'm gonna have to do that in the wrong order. I do not know. But I guess it's fine. Looks like it's my turn. Ready, sweetie. Okay, so let's take out Knox. Huh. Now we have to get the pots while dealing with Tiandra. Then he was able to provide the ploy buff, so that's also very good with exposure. But really didn't need it for that much for that first match. All right, time for the next match. Okay, so what we have here is we have, okay, we have six units, but they're gonna be very hard to deal with. As we can tell, we have a lot of dual units. Duo Shamir. Well, they don't actually have, they don't have a dual building. How do they have four or three dual units with no dual building? What? Okay, we have Duo Shamir. We have Ephraim. We have Sigurd. We have Lysithia plus one. We have Ninja Camilla and we have Azura. Okay. So since there's six units, this is telling me I should probably try a Gale Force of some kind. Yeah, a Gale Force of some kind. Doesn't seem like it would be too much of a problem to do that. Yeah, I just want to see if we can take out some pots earlier than that though. Um, so we'll try, let's see, which team has a lot of actions? I could try that team. Oh, I can actually try this for the first time. Actually, we need, we need a team that can deal with Ninja Camilla if need be. That's, that's mostly the main thing. Okay, so it'd probably be the Cav team. Because like Sony doesn't have hardy bearing on this one, so I probably don't want to do it here. Yeah, let's tr let's try this team. Okay, now. Hmm. Alright, so I think. 
Is it fine? Honestly, I have no idea. I probably made a mistake. At this point, For all life who knows? Prepare to be okay. impressed. So now, what we need to do Quiet down. is this, this, and this. <sighs> Yeah, let me do this. Let me take out Shamir. Or okay, hold we'll on. See this let me through. do this first. I do not know. Okay. Uh, um. I'm gonna take out Ephraim first. <laughs> I like cutting it closed, don't I? <laughs> Oh wait, okay, so I did make a huge Maybe mistake. This way. Off I go. Oh, okay. I could still I could still save it. Oh my god. I almost There is no choice. Okay, good, good, good. I almost made a very, very huge mistake. I'll just take out Shimera. Should probably pay attention to what's the correct order here. Okay, so uh um definitely need to take out Um So I would take out Lysithia I guess and then you would duo skill We'll see this through Take out Sigur Good morning. Ready. All right, well, you gotta leave it. That was definitely a mistake, but of course. I would always make a mistake on that one. Alright, let's try for the next match. Alright, this one, let's see this one. We have a Joshua that's plus one Wings of Mercy. We have Peony with Wings of Mercy plus one. We have Tundra that's plus one with Wings of Mercy. Celeph that's plus one without Wings of Mercy. Okay, we got some variety. Uh, we have Duo Chrom, we have Brave Chrom. Yeah, very proud. I almost said fallen for a second. And we have not. Okay, uh... I don't see a Harding Bearing. I do see a Joshua, though, that does have some Wound Sweep elements. Other than Joshua, though, um... Should be fairly okay for Ninja Camilla to handle... Everything? <laughs> um, I'd have to be careful that, uh... I guess self will be locked. So maybe... Maybe we keep self locked. Actually, we, we can't even keep self locked. Can we? Actually, the double isolation team can. But we need a dancer. We need a dancer. Okay, so we could do this. We'll try the double isolation team for this. For the one I love. Okay, so let's see. So we need double silences here. I still want Joshua to get around. Or maybe we should just tank everyone else besides Joshua. Uh, we'll try this. Yeah, this is fine. Stealthy as can be. I think Ninja Camilla should be able to handle mostly everything here. Okay, yeah. 
Ready, sweetie. And then turn to you. We'll see what we do. Good morning. Pleasant orders. I don't think there's any way for them to pass us. Let's find happiness. We'll put Fjorm here. I'm trying to think, can Krom get all the way past Camilla? What sense would it make? Yeah, what sense would it make? Uh, I mean, he's gonna be locked, and he can't get danced out of it. So. Careful! Careful! I love you. Ah. Yes. Upon your word. I just, I just go with this. Before I make another mistake. Should be enough to take out not. Your life is mine. I right, take out Peony. Take out Krom. Can take out Krom. Wait, did I just repeat myself? Can take out Tiandra. And then Josh will be out of range. And self will be slowed. Stealthy as can be. Make sure okay we have return. Alright, let's just check this. Okay. I was hoping that wasn't gonna be the case. Did but it looks like it is. Maybe this way. Good Anyway. Orders. Let's find happiness. I bestow my blessing. Hmm. Like this. Okay. Now we need to go get the pots over there. I go. Somehow. It will be done. Careful, careful. Stuff was uh, slow before with stalls, so that's why nothing happened. Ready, sweetie. All right, now it's time to no time to, to get past Joshua. At least that's the plan. That's how old that, that's how old Goto is. Anyway. Alright, so that's those are the two the three matches. Alright, let's see the fence. And we have a win and a loss. I usually always check these before I do my offensive matches just to see what they were. The the loss is actually pretty nice. They did a really good strategy, so I'm um, looking forward to see this replay. So let's go with it. All right, uh, as as you know, this week is water season and fire season, and you always want to make your defense tailored to the bonuses, what blessings or what season it is, and what are the strong. So um, legendary Hinoka, I'm scared of. Leg uh, Legendary Lear I'm scared of, those are the fire season units. Um, obviously Claude is also a very strong unit. Um, I thought about Summer Fjorm, I thought about um, you know Dimitri tanks, Bridal Tiki. But my map is mostly tailored towards Gatekeeper, um, Gatekeeper and Legendary Hinoka and um, female Legendary Alir. Um, there are some holes that definitely can be exploited by like Brave Corn and stuff, but those are the ones I focus on today. So we have Medius. He's a little bit weaker than before because he's using a drive speed to help with Corn with speed. So um, can be able to tank the first hit and then get off Special Spiral. We have Sony that's being added with Pass. 
Also, he has Harding Bearing and Blazing Wind, so she'll get her ultimate on turn one, or special on turn one from Garrick, because Garrick will provide that with the pulse. Garrick also has joint drive speed to provide more speed for Corrin. Also, Thor also has pass, so this is again ge geared towards dealing with Gatekeeper. And we have Ninja Camilla with just her kind of standard stuff. A seal to help with speed with corn as well, and they have Tiantra that has water sweep. Kind of really isn't doing much, but just dancing Garrick and hopefully putting, you know, you know, whatever. Not really doing much. And also Garrick has odd pulse die as normal, so. Alright, we're against Nerf Thieves with Gale Horse, um, Askar, the Wind Tribe Claude, Plumeria, um, Legendary Violet, and we also have Edelgard with Gale Force. Now I do have Legendary Violet, but I decided not to use him. Um, I might change my team and put him in later, but I just, I kind of just forgot about it to be honest. I have too many green units to worry about. We have Sony, we have Corn, we have uh, New Peony. Um, Nightmares. Yeah, too many green units. Duo Zero, Garrick. I honestly forgot. Let's see what's going on here. Is anybody gonna tank? Lady Freya's name. Okay, I, I I have already forgot what happened. Okay, so uh, maybe they're eyeing trying to take out that duo building. I don't know. I'll be afraid of it, I guess. Okay, no, they want to just take that one out. Okay. Avert your eyes. All right. Energies wants to fight. <laughs> Medis. Oh wow, that was very close. If I had a damage special on, maybe I would've actually taken her out. But then again, I, I, I live because of my damage special, so... Was it worth? Probably not, because uh, the dude has Gale Force, so... Maybe it wasn't worth all, overall. That was very close, though. Alright, and now let's see, guess what happened? Ninja Kimono wants it. Oh my god, the quad Your on Adelgard. Is mine. I detest swimming. That's our AoE special. Ha! That's how you handle Quad. Just make sure he's at 1 HP when he starts. Dust in the wind. Now, we dare give him an action. I okay. More to give. All right, Thor gets danced. I want to ask our- oh my god, Thor's now doubling! What is going on? Why is that speed gets nothing? Oh. Alright, that's it. Now for the great, great defense. Attack. Well, my map was geared towards Gatekeeper, but he's still here, and he still wins, so you know what? He didn't do anything. Also have, uh, the new Peony. The... what is it called? I don't even remember what it's called anymore. <laughs> I honestly don't even remember. I thought it starts today, but I don't know. Alright, so we have Summer Fjorm. We have Bridal... or not Bridal. Brave Corn. Maybe I wish Bridal. But, um, yeah, so... We had Golveg initially, but I swapped to Thor at the very last second because we, we couldn't use a Duo Hindrance without Duo Thor. Which now opens us up to you, Brave Corn, sadly. We have a uh, Peony, and we also have uh, Nerthus. Oh, this is a very clever positional thing. I still don't know how it worked out exactly, but we will see. There's some something. I mean, there, there's a way it could have worked out. Alright, so Fiorum's gonna stay there, and Corn is gonna sort of protect for far save. Pleasant dreams. Alright, Derek gets dance. And again. And then Korn's gonna attack first. Which was I think the big mistake here. I don't know how they were able to get this to work. But it did. Because then Um Ninja Camilla then attacks. Your life is mine. Which again, uh doesn't really do much. I won't accept defeat. 
Then they have uh, just a normal movement they can get by. But the AoE special doesn't hit corn. I won't accept defeat. And then uh, takes out Thor, of course. And then also, Sonya's AoE special doesn't hit. So, seemed like all of it was for naught. See, again, if Corn was to attack last, uh, my brave Corn could have taken out Fjorm after all those AoE specials. But, um, yeah, that's the one thing I wasn't really sure about. Because I feel like the past really didn't help. Yeah, I felt like it didn't really help at all. But I thought it was supposed to work against Gatekeeper's uh, non-warping thing, but maybe... Believe in me. Maybe I just misread something. Anyway, all the units are taken out besides uh, Tiandra. Which is the last. Anyway, and that's the match, so... Thank you guys for watching, hopefully some of the matches were good to watch. And we'll see you guys next time. We're going to get this out early because I'm going to be very busy tomorrow. So I got to try and do it as early as possible. Anyway. Oh, I kind of accidentally turned it off. <laughs> I guess I'm done with the video. All right, later guys. Thank you guys for watching. Peace out.